Hey guys, what's up? This is Phil from iPodTouchBaller.com. Thank you guys for checking out this video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to jailbreak your iPhone or iPod Touch on the newest 3.1.2 software or 3.1.2 firmware. So, um, yeah, before I get started, let's go over some disclaimers. Number one, this will work on every single iDevice, but not completely on every single iDevice. If you have a jail, if you have an unlocked iPhone 3G or 3GS, do not do this. You're going to need to update to a stand to a um, official Apple firmware. So if you rely on an unlock, your baseband will also be upgraded. And I believe there is a soft unlock for it, but I'm not completely sure. You don't want to take the chance. So if you rely on an unlock, stay where you are for now. Wait for a little bit later. We might have some stuff for you guys. Also, if you're on the third generation iPod Touch. Or if you bought it within about the past month, and it's a 32 gigabyte or 64 gigabyte, mine's a 32 gig, but it's the second gen, uh, then this will be a tethered jailbreak. So every time that you turn your device off, you will re need to rerun the program to boot it back up. This is a pain in the butt, but it is really not much we can do about it. So just go ahead and uh, if you're on a third generation, you can go ahead and do this. Just make sure you have a computer around when you turn it off again. And that includes when like it dies or something. So I'll be doing this on my iPod Touch second generation. So yeah, let's get into this. The first thing that you're going to need to do is upgrade your device to a stock 3.1.2 firmware. I'll show you that I have this running right now. 3.1.2, that's the newest firmware. It's an official uh, upgrade. So what you want to do is open up iTunes and just click the restore button and let it go. You want to do it restore if you update. I haven't really tried. Just restore it. So uh, yeah. The next thing you want to do is on your computer, you want to go to the the uh, website in the video description, blackrain.com. That is blackrain.com. Except don't eat for the I in rain. You want to put it as a, the number one. And you'll get this picture of Geohot, the guy that uh, does this basically. So you'll get a picture of Geohot right there with a bunch of iPhones. And then just scroll down and you'll see the Windows logo, because this is for Windows. You'll see the Windows logo. If you click the Windows logo, it'll bring up a download box. Hit save file. Alright. Now that you have it saved, just go ahead and double click on it hit OK. It might bring up something like that. Hit Run. And you're going to get this little tiny box right here. OK? And there's going to be one button on the whole thing, and it's going to say, Make It Rain. Make sure, of course, once again, that your iPod Touch is on. You don't need to put it in recovery mode or anything. You can go ahead and just leave it on, which is great for this. So go ahead and click the button that says, Make It Rain when you're ready. It's going to say entering recovery mode. This is what your iPhone's going to do. It's going to get into recovery mode. It's going to say running. You're going to get a picture of Geohot. Then you're going to get this that says enjoy your jailbroken iPhone. The jailbreak is done once the iPhone reboots. It's basically already done, which is great. So just go ahead and hit OK. It says done, wait for reboot, and you're just going to wait for it. You, that might come up saying it's uh, notice one in recovery mode. Just hit OK and then exit out of iTunes and just wait for it. You see, there's a little spinny wall, little spinny wheel down there. Just wait for your iPhone to come back on. This may take a little while. Just wait for it. And now it's rebooting. Now like I've already said, this is my iPod Touch 2G. 32 gigabyte. If you're running the 3G, which is the 32 or 64 gigabyte version that you bought within the last month or so, 
then this will be a tether jailbreak, but if you're on the iPhone, iPod Touch first or second generation, it should be fine. Or on the iPhone, any of the iPhones. So yeah, go ahead and slide to unlock here. And you'll get this thing right there called Black Rain. That's what's installed. Open it up, and you'll be greeted with this little page right here. Using cached app list, it says the app list cannot be downloaded. That's because I haven't set up a... Uh, Oh, that's something you want to do. Sorry about that. You want to connect your iPod or whatever to a Wi-Fi connection. <laughs> um, I'm going to do that really quickly. Sorry about that. Um, putting in the password here. Kind of a long one. There we go. Alright, now that you're connected to Wi-Fi, you can continue with this step. Go back, open up Black Rain. You'll see all this stuff. You can do IC Cydia in the Rock app, or you can uninstall it. I'm going to go ahead and just do them all, just for the sake. Then hit install at the top, and just wait for it. It's going to download and install it all the stuff that you checked off onto your phone or iPod. I'm going to do them all just because I really feel like it. <laughs> but if you just wanted a normal jailbreak, then you could just do Cydia. And if you wanted either of the other two afterwards, you could just do that. Alright? But yeah, we're just going to wait for that. And you can go ahead and close out of the Purple Rain dialog box if you'd like. I don't know why I didn't. Yeah, just wait for that all. Let's say respringing. Please wait. And your iPod will respring. Slide to unlock. And there is all the stuff that you got. So now you're jailbroken with Cydia and everything on the newest firmware and everything works perfectly. So... That's how you jailbreak the newest firmware. Um, quick little update. I want to thank everyone who um, commented on my video yesterday, the uh, promo code giveaway. If you haven't yet, video description, I have a link to it, as well as probably an annotation somewhere here. All right. Um, I really want to thank everybody who went over there and commented and uh, entered that giveaway. I uploaded about 10 hours ago, I'd say, and I already got my first honor on it. I got... 48 most discussed today big thanks to you guys um, that really does mean a lot so um, yeah thank you guys for keeping everything keeping up with me not really keeping up with me uh, for sticking with me I should say um, even though I haven't been making the kind of videos I should have been lately um, or the amount I should say that I should have been so big thanks and yeah so this is Phil from iPodTouchBall.com. Go ahead and enter that promo code giveaway. Get in on everything. And, uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Later.